Well, this new Health Sciences building will really change everything about how we train here at the college. We have, uh, through the community college, a simulation mobile unit that's used to some extent, but this is going to be a whole simulation hospital. 20,000 square feet of this facility will be devoted to that simulated environment. Our obligation for our students is to provide state-of-the-art equipment and to keep it up to date. It will be very similar to what they're going to see if they go into Vida Edgecombe Hospital or to Nash General Hospital. It was nerve-wracking when we had to interact with a real-life patient and have to do different techniques with our patients. And they would talk to us and say, well, you don't know what you're doing because you're new. But you know, this simulator is real life. It'll tell you if you're doing something wrong. You know, it'll tell you if you're doing something right. And I think that once a student goes into the clinical setting, they'll have the confidence with dealing with a patient and they'll say, you know what, we can do it. We can do it just as well as someone that has been working for a couple of years. It's state of the art. It, it is, simulation training is the way that across the country, uh, doctors, nurses, uh, clinical staff are being trained these days. Edgecombe Community College has a very important role for the local community. The college is worried about meeting the needs of its community and that's really our mission. We're dedicated to the cultural training and educational needs of this community. I think you can get the same education as you can here that you can in a four-year college and you can save a lot of money, you can save a lot of drive time. And I'm just really glad that you know I decided to do something different, come back to college. It took me 10 years after high school to come back and just say one thing, it's never too late to come back and start over. It really starts in the classroom. Um, one of the areas that health care can improve in is to train our students to work with one another. They were really good with the skill set that they were specializing in. But in terms of learning how to work with other disciplines, being able to lead a team, being able to be an effective member of a team was critical. So we even, even have our classrooms in this new building set up in circular shapes. They'll be able to interact with each other to work on projects in the classroom, to discuss concepts. Uh, they'll have video right there from the instructor in front of them. The college has established a legacy campaign. Community members may contribute to that legacy campaign. If they contribute anything from $10,000 on down, they will be a part of the Investor Society. $10,000 on up, they would be a part of the naming rights of the facility. People are living longer. The technology is ensuring that they have access to a healthcare provider. They have medications that they need to continue a, a long lifespan. So we believe that healthcare jobs will continue to be important in the future of this state and this nation.